वेलकम स्टूडेंट टुडे वी स्टार्ट अ न्यू टॉपिक जेनेटिक इंजीनियरिंग इन प्लांट्स सो इन द जेनेटिक इंजीनियरिंग फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल वी स्टार्ट द फर्स्ट टाइप ऑफ टेक्निक वी कॉल्ड एज एग्रोबैक्टीरियम मीडिएटेड जीन ट्रांसफर एग्रोबैक्टीरियम इज अ सोइल बैक्टीरियम दिस सोइल बैक्टीरियम हैविंग अ नेचुरल एबिलिटी और टेंडेंसी टू इंफेक्ट द plant plant cell so any or specially dicotyledonous plant like a tomato tobacco peas can be infected by the agrobacterium which is present in the soil agrobacterium having a its own genome or chromosome with its own genome or chromosome agrobacterium having its own plasmid and this plasmid is a very special kind of plasmid so this plasmid uh, specially known as the ti plasmid why because it containing a part of dna this part because the ti dna causes the infection or responsible for the infection to the plant cell now you see that agrobacterium causes cancerous growth in the plant after infection means when plant at particular part or tissue like stem wounded by certain reason what happen agrobacterium tumefaciens like bacteria enter into that wound or comes in contact with the wound get activated and then what happen ti plasmid is actually responsible for to induce the cell proliferation in the plant as well as ti plasmid is also responsible for the multiplication of the bacterial population so specially what happen ti plasmid giving the bacterium its property to infect the plant and cause the crown gall one of the cancerous tumor tcs in plants now you see that in this case a figure shows that this particular agrobacterium tuberculosis have its own chromosome with the own chromosome having tdna this tdna is also called as a ti plasmid special ti plasmid containing tdna this tdna is a very special region of the ti uh, region of the ti plasmid why because this tdna having certain genes those genes actually responsible for the infection or crown gall disease in plant so what happen you see here a soil conditions are there those conditions having agrobacterium tumefaciens means bacterium those causes infection and other bacteria as also and this is a tomato plant one of the figure shows a host genome is a chromosome plant cell and this figure also shows that means figure number c also shows that a little green part is there which is a inserted tdna which comes from the agrobacterium after infection so this tdna is actually when integrated with the plant genome responsible for the cell proliferation or cancer growth and you see that in the figure number d crown gall which is a tumor plant tumor which is produced after proliferation after proliferation after proliferation in the cell now you see that plant stem and infection a wound on the stem plant allows the bacteria to invade and cause the cancerous proliferation so ti means tumor inducing plasmid approximately having 200 kilobase per size and carries the genes those required for the infection to the plant cell now we see that 
what and how the agrobacterium is responsible for the infection to the plant you know that a part which integrate with the plant genome which is responsible for the infection in the plant known as a tdna known as a tdna now question arises how tdna can integrate with the plant genome so what happened here tdna integrate with the plant genome after infection by the bacteria by the way of non homologous recombination so non homologous recombination can integrate the tdna means bacterial a part of gene or part of dna to the plant genome now it is a part of plant genome and what happen this tdna is responsible for the further development of the cell which is not a normal we got as a cancerous development or a uh, proliferation this tdna having a, a size near about 23 kilobiosphere and it containing all the properties or genes which induces the cancerous growth now you see that a uh, different ti plasmid having different uh, uh pine one of the region in the ti plasmid now you see that how it looks ti plasmid having a tdna region this tdna region is flanked with two border regions known as the left border and right border so these are very uh, small sequences having near about 25 base pair known as a 25 base pair in perfect direct repeats those sequences those sequences actually responsible or necessary the integration of tdna into the plant genome integration of tdna into the plant genome now you see that in between the left border and right border sequences a uh, few major gene sequences are there uh, one is auxin then cytokinin and opine you know that auxin and cytokinin are the plant hormone in this case these genes or sequences also responsible for the uh, induction in excess or major amount of synthesis of plant hormone auxin and cytokinin which is responsible for the cell growth and cell development especially uh, in normal quantity auxin and cytokinin produced in the plant cell or in the plant but due to the tdna it produces in excess quantity now you see that opine another region this opine region having speciality because having a number of genes uh, near about this particular tdna having approximately 35 genes out of 35 genes uh, those are generally responsible for the virulent action of this uh, tdna or bacteria it also can, uh, contains agrobacterium origin of replication means ora region which is required for the uh, replication of the tdna or the plasmid now you see that in this case opine region have its own speciality so what is the speciality of the opaline you know that opa opine is a one of the product produced by the uh, infected plant so this product utilized by the bacteria as a carbon and energy source means whole and sole source of the carbon and energy is opine for the agrobacterium during the infection process so one of the example of the opine is nopaline so nopaline is formed through the reductive condensation of arginine and alpha ketoglutarate so after that what happen here nopaline is a complete carbon and energy source of agrobacterium agrobacterium only can able to metabolize the nopaline so no other soil bacteria having this capability so 
due to this what happened this is a one of the competitive edge or selective advantage to the agrobacterium or other bacteria and whole and soul maximum opaline utilized by the agrobacterium for their own proliferation as well as causing infection to the plant and developing the crown gall or cancerous tumor growth in plant cell or plant now you think about that how the plant and agrobacterium which containing special plasmid ti plasmid interaction happen and now you think about that this plasmid we can use in the gene transfer in the gene transfer in genetic engineering so this ti <coughs> dna or tdna or ti plasmid play a very vital role in transferring any novel or desirable gene from the from the selected library of genes to the host cell so this is about the first topic and first content how the agrobacterium tumefacient causes the crown gall and how we can in future utilize the agrobacterium as a one of the bacteria or ti plasmid as a vector to transfer the desirable novel gene okay in plant by the way of genetic engineering technique thank you